Congressman, Congressman Lou actually resigns, if it's within that 80-day window that he calls for an election, then we are going to do that uh, via a convention, which for us Democrats basically means the PCPs and folks in the CD1 would nominate uh, um, a, a, a candidate. Um, so that in that case, there would not be any primary per se. The more likely thing, and actually the latest I heard from Kitzhaber's office, is that I think his intention, but don't quote me on it, is, uh, is that uh, he's, he's going to look to, after, uh, uh, after that 80-day period, and he, I think, would prefer to, and I'm not speaking for him, but I think that he's already spoken through his representatives, um, that his intention is to go ahead and do a primary. And so that means that, uh, once again, it's, it's going to be a primary similar to the primary that we were looking at for later in the year. Um, it means that we as a committee will not be making any recommendations on candidates for the, you know, who, are, who are running in that primary. We won't be supporting a candidate as a committee until after the primary happens. That being said, I think that it's to our advantage to have any candidates who want to come and speak with us um, to do that. And the way that I'd like to do it is, is to be as equitable as possible, uh, maybe have a, um, you know, a forum um, where everybody, you know, all the uh, candidates come and speak, and speak to the group. And that could be before one of our regular meetings or after one of our regular meetings. Um, we'll figure